What's up? It's Coach AK with 365 days of AK and it is day 262. Now, this post is gonna be a little bit more on the controversial side, maybe, not sure, but ideally it's about um, giving and giving publicly and letting people know that you give. Now, this came up to me, as I, this thought came up to me when uh, Prince recently passed away and some of his friends have coming out talking about all the good, or a lot of good that he did. But most of the good that he did was actually in covert ways of um, giving back to communities in a large way. It's, it's really good to hear. Um, unfortunately, we would love to hear it when he was still alive. Now, the controversial piece actually comes because maybe this term has actually come from more of the biblical standpoint of um, uh, text that says, do not let your left hand know what your right hand is doing. And that's usually in terms of giving to the needy. So if you're going to give, make sure you do it privately and not boast in the streets. Now, the controversial piece actually comes because we are, this comes from the New Testament. And... Within the New Testament, we're following, or it's about the teachings of Jesus Christ, a guy that most definitely gave very publicly and also did very, a lot of miracles very publicly. And that's how we're able to know some of the work that he's done today. See, right now, as I come back to the original post about how Prince gave publicly, there's a lot of celebrities, a lot of athletes, a lot of people around the world that are doing a lot of amazing things. Unfortunately, we don't always know about that. You know about what they do on the field, what they do on the stage, what they do on the movies, but you do not know what they do to make this world a better place. You hear about their negative, but you don't always hear about their positive. See, the thing about athletes and these celebrities is that they do have such high impact and such high influence that if we're able to see what they did publicly, maybe it would be so infectious that the rest of the population follows suit i.e. you have the ice bucket challenge, you have a lot of these things that are people are doing a lot of good things around the world when you have these influential people doing good. But unfortunately what we do is we sometimes only see the negatives, the stuff that they see in the media, the stuff that they want to, the media portrays. So I'm going to say to you, maybe showing some of the good you're doing around the world can actually become infectious for other people around you to do the same. Instead of doing it in privately, find ways to do it publicly. Because sometimes these leaders, these celebrities, these people around the world are doing some great things, but if they did it publicly, they're good leaders, they're good influencers, and it may be able to lead our world, our country, our society, our communities, our families in a more positive direction if we could see more good around the world from these people that are doing amazing things already with such influence. Thank you.